Hi, my name is Roland. I'm on location right now at Tag Paintball here in Hollister. And uh, we're going to be doing a video, it's called the Kool-Aid Test. And this Kool-Aid Test is going to be taste, uh, testing the water solubility of our paintballs. I've been told for years that our paintballs are water soluble. And if they do have PEG, or what they call polyethylene glycol, then yes, they are soluble. However, if they are mixed in with oil, well, we all know that oil and water doesn't seem to mix. And in Ephesians it says, <clears throat> that uh, you shouldn't be part of the darkness, but you should be exposing the darkness. And that's what this video is about to do. Unfortunately, the reason we have to do the video is because of that part of scripture it says in Proverbs, is the love of money is the root of all evil. And so we're going to demonstrate that now. I've already pre-punctured uh, the paintballs. And I'm going to be just squirting them inside. Again, this has been coined by one of the distributors as the Kool-Aid test. Because uh, when you're all done, it should look like Kool-Aid. So far I've personally found 45 different name brands that either have too much oil or are too hard. So, a little stirring it up, not to contaminate it, do it again. Alright, now we've actually let the uh, paint settle, it's been about five minutes, and so we can take a look and we're zooming in to uh, the one that's almost completely oil, and you can actually see how it's actually settling in two areas. One is at the surface, and that shows the oil content, whether that's mineral, vegetable, or reconstituted oil. It doesn't really matter to me. It's oil. And I thought in our country we had a problem with uh, oil, but apparently we're putting it in our paintballs for some reason. Then, of course, uh, to the other one, it's a little mix of a, a little bit of both. We have just a little bit of oil at the top, but still, there's oil. Then of course the last one is almost 100% PEG, that's polyethylene glycol. That's the stuff that's uh, made of, you know, gummy bears are made of, and of course that's the stuff that is uh, um, really uh, environmentally friendly to our surface. So when any time you get shot or uh, you know the bunkers get hit, it can be really uh, cleaned up, rectified really quickly, and there won't be as uh, much staining, if at all. Uh, I know there's always that potential, you always have to say virtually, um, but there is that possibility. But, you know, in my humble opinion, 23 years, I've never seen it happen. It's the stuff that's this or the mix, the stuff that we're trying to um, avoid. So when you do test your paintballs, just, uh, you know, a cup of water just like we showed you, uh, and then you can uh, wait a couple of seconds, maybe a minute or two, and you can always see the, when the water uh, separates from the oil, it'll always enter the surface.